Well, good morning, Calvary. Thanks for tuning in for your word for the day and happy 2023. We are back with your word for the day in the fresh new year. I hope that this is off to a great start for you. But I've been around long enough to know that sometimes New Year's don't always start in new, refreshing, and wonderful ways. Maybe you're pushing up against some things already. Maybe you were hoping and and praying that 2023 would be the end of some tension and issues you had with some people. Maybe some situations you were hoping would, would disappear over the holidays, but here they are in a new year. And uh, as we're taking some time to to walk through the book of Psalms, I love how Psalm chapter 3 starts. It says, O Lord, how many are my foes? Many are rising against me. Many are saying of my soul, there's no salvation for him in God. Man, maybe you've got some foes today. Maybe some people are accusing you, are, are judging you, of condemning you. And if that's the case, I want to keep reading Psalm chapter 3 for some encouragement. Because verse 3, it says, But you, O Lord, are a shield for me, my glory and the lifter of my head. I I cried aloud to the Lord, and he answered me from his holy hill. So if you today are facing some foes, if you're facing some adversaries, if there's some conflict and tension, if people are accusing and condemning you, let me encourage you in a few things today. First, stand in your faith in Jesus. Stand strong with him. No matter what people around you say, no matter if they're condemning you from a a conflict place, or even as uh, Psalm 3 says here, even in your faith, how could you be a follower of Jesus because of what you've done? Stand firm on your faith in the character of Jesus Christ, walking with him every single day. And secondly, remind yourself of what it says here in Psalm 3, that the Lord is a shield to you. That, that he is a lifter of your head, that he hears and encourages you from the holy hill, as it says there in Psalm 3. So the world around you may be full of condemnation and accusation and judgment, but the Lord is full of encouragement and hope and, and refuge for that. And reminder that we can't always find what we need in this world, but we can always find what we need in our relationship and our walk with Jesus. The shielding, the encouragement, the embrace that we need is found in Jesus. So I hope that in this new year, if it's not off to the start you're looking for, I hope that that drives you to Jesus and trusting and walking with him. And if things are going well, let this be a reminder that the Lord is a shield and he may be working actively to shield you from some gnarly things today and use that to worship him and be thankful for him. So I hope that you have a great start to your year, and I hope that you remember that the Lord is a shield to you. Have a great day, Calvary. We'll see you next time.